from Jamaica. Uh, although music isn't something I played when I was in Jamaica. I was very young. I left there when I was seven years old. Um, went back every year till I was 13. Moved from Jamaica to Brooklyn, New York. And in Brooklyn, New York, I went to Catholic school, so I spent my entire life dodging all the kids from public school. They were trying to beat up the kids from Catholic school, so uh, no time for music there. Um, but when I moved to Connecticut in high school, um, I got the bug for music, and particularly for guitar, by hearing a George Benson album. And I never really listened to jazz much, never really listened to, you know, I was listening to rock and roll, to uh, reggae at the time, uh, R&B music. And I heard this George Benson album, and uh, it was the other side of Abbey Road. He did all the Beatles songs. And of course, I was familiar with the Beatles songs, but I never heard them done this way. And his fluency on the instrument just, I don't know, it just grabbed me. I was actually given the album by a friend of mine who hated it because he was into Creedence Clearwater Revival, and this was the total opposite of what he loved. So he said, Hey, do you want this album? I said, Sure, I'll take it. And um, kind of fell in love with the guitar ever since then.
music is, is what I call intellectual fun. It's music that um, I really spend a lot of time crafting and putting together, but it should sound like it's fun. It should be enjoyable to listen to. Uh, as one of the reviewers said for, uh, for the CD, which, who I think got it perfectly, it's what I like to call my music, smooth jazz with a brain.
Thank you so much. Starting tomorrow. I started kind of late. You know, starting in high school is a late uh, start. You know, I was around um, 16. Um, and so I had a lot of friends who had been playing for years and they were pretty proficient and I felt I was way behind. So for me, the only way to catch up was uh, every waking moment I practiced. So school days I would do three hours, three and a half hours. Uh, weekends I'd do four, four and a half hours. Um, uh, and trying to get the proficiency, getting the fingers to work, learning the instrument, learning theory, because my guitar teacher was actually a classical guitarist, so he was teaching me Andres Segovia, he was teaching me all these other things, reading music and so on. And um, I'd say within about uh, two to three years, I felt I became not good, not proficient, but I was able to at least play the instrument. 